hello guys in this video I'm going to show you how to open a text file in uh, vb.net so first of all what I'm going to do is take a rich text box and then a open file dialog then I'm going to take a menu strip okay so three things are there <clears throat> a rich text box I'm going to adjust it a little bit a rich text box then I have a menu strip here then a open file dialog which I have taken now first of all here in the menu strip what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, make it like a menu first of all file then here open file okay these two things now what we are going to do is we are going to double click on this open file and write our code here so first of all I'm going to take a uh, string dim streamr is the name of the variable as a stream reader Alright, so this stream reader basically it's showing red underline. I need to import system.io. Alright, here system.io is imported. <coughs> then open file dialog one dot filter equal to <clears throat> text file so this will filter when we open our dialog box so that it will only show the text files or star dot txt or if you want all the files to be shown then we can use this all files star dot star okay then we shall check if the file exists if it is equal to true then
if open file dialog one dot show dialog equal to windows dot form dot dialog result dot ok then try this dot open file stream r which is our variable file dot open text open dialog box one dot file name okay so this will read the uh, file into a stream now what we are going to do is uh, we are going to take this stream into a, our a rich text box rich text box one dot text equal to stream r dot read to end Okay. If there is any exception, we are going to write for that one. MSG box. Ex. Dot message. And try and if and sub. So now let's uh, run this code. So this is uh, the uh, menu strip. Okay, we have missed one of the formats here. Let's correct that one. Start dot start. Okay, now let's run it again. Hope it won't give any errors. Alright, so we are at the documents. Let's take one of the text files. So, it has been read here. In next video, what I'm going to do is basically count the number of words in this text file so stay tuned guys and do like the video if it worked well and yeah see you in the next video